Not just a great experience for the young men and women from these regions, but also a huge opportunity. If you can work your way through, get yourself in the shout of being a ranked fighter, a, uh, a potential medal winner, it can bring all sorts of things, get your name noticed, and the doors can open. And there you see now, now Ariano from France. And France, what a uh, couple of years they have had with regards to mixed martial arts. Finally legalized in France is the sport. So the athletes from there can now compete in their home country. You see some huge shows happening in France. And it can only be a good thing. So heavyweight action is upon us here. Day one of the IMAF 2021 World Championships. Hafiz Ullah Hamza from Pakistan in the blue corner will take on Francis Nel Arenio in the red corner. Oh, and a step in left hook. Nicely done there from a Hamza. Over at cage four, making his way to the cage in the blue corner. Representing Slovakia. Both very, very Marcel thick set men. Simo. Power in both hands, power in every single limb. Oh, stepping for that left hook again. His opponent in the red corner. Oh, these are big shots. Lusa Brando. So once again, can all staff on the cage two please return to your cage? That's all staff on cage oh, two. Oh, faked with the right hand, cage. stepped in with the left and came back with the right. Very different striking styles between these two. Hamza, that huge overhands, big hooks, more technical. Sniper-like style coming from Nel Aranio from France. Oh, those overhands. And again, it's just going to take one touch, one clean connection. But those big shots, even when you miss, you're still burning that energy. It's not an efficient style. It's certainly an eye-catching one when they do connect. Oh, the right hand comes over the top here. <laughs> he really does have a... Hamza really does have like a bite down in your mouthpiece style. Looking to count, it's quicker than he looks as well. Oh, nice kick though there, mixing it up is the Frenchman. Oh, and a takedown. Good, good mix. Change of Once styles again, there from up. From now. Oh, but back to his feet and swinging hard is Hamza. Now moving forward now, still these big hooks coming, 30 seconds left in this first round. I think it's just a numbers game, surely one of them's got to connect at some point, that's a nice jab there from Hamza. And those kicks are nice, you saw there, a little grimace, and again he attacks the outside of that calf, that's causing him problems, you can see. Already raising that lead leg is Hamza. Let's see if Nell looks to go back to that weapon. Oof. Three minutes down. There is a different energy about this. Some blood there. Just on the ear of uh, Hamza. I think that's just a... Uh, in the midst of the grappling, I think. But two very different styles. One a superbly effective weapon towards the end of that round was that outside leg kick. 
And his opponents in the that outside leg kick from now Ariano from France. And you can see straight away Hamza ate two of them and then already taking the weight off that lead leg, walking more sheepishly. And when you do that, you're not just taking, sorry, damaging that limb, but you're also taking the movement, potentially the power out of a, a big swinger like Hamza. Let's see if Nell looks to go back to those attacks. Set and ready, round two, this heavyweight contest here at the 2021 IMAF World Championships here in Abu Dhabi. Oh, Hamza swinging forward, Nell covering up, moving well, avoiding any clean shots getting through. There's the outside kick. Straight away he's raising his leg, that's the weapon of choice now. And when you're not used to taking leg kicks, it is something which is uh, so hard to describe just how painful they are when those big heavy shins, especially in heavyweights, bury into the outside of your thigh, that sciatic nerve, or even down towards the calf. But look how it's changed the game now of, of Hamza. He's so worried about that kick. He tried to catch the kick and now, now uses that now to reverse the position. Good, good work from Francis Nell oh, Ariano. Number three, this fight ends as a unanimous decision in favor of the fighter in the red corner, representing And now Hamza way. looking for a take down of his own. He's in on this single. Good balance though from Nell. Oh, and that reversal with the wizard, beautifully done. Absolutely superb, and then steps effortlessly into full mount. One minute, 35 seconds as well to play with here. Oh, big shots. Hamza just covering up. Might take the arm here. Oh, Hamza turns the other way. Unanswered shots, now Nell completely in control here. Back mount, shot after shot, and that is all the ref needed to see. Hamza from Pakistan certainly has a fun style and a dangerous one at that. But Nell Ariano, once he attacked with those leg kicks and got a reaction, that was the start, that was the beginning of the end. A stunning, absolutely brilliant performance. And it was the difference. He simply found the weapon that was having the biggest effect. Over at cage number three, making his way to the cage. And you can see it now. Hamza is absolutely, absolutely McKenna. exhausted. Alongside, I'm sure, hugely his disappointed. In the red corner, representing the United. But you Arab can see, Emirates. even when he's back to his Sayed feet, still struggling on that lead leg. And the referee calls for the contest for you win a by TKO in round two. In the red corner, representing France, Nell Ariano. Nell Ariano from France takes the victory, gets the finish, and moves forward in the competition. Portugal, 
Rui Morgado. 